started doing what most people think of when they think of fitness and just like lifting light weights and trying to do cardio, which I don't like cardio at all. So I found that I was just spending time doing things that I didn't like to do. And one of my friends who's lifting here now too, um, said, well, why don't you just start lifting heavy? So I was like, okay. And found that not only is it fun to lift heavy and see what you're capable of, but it's like empowering to see, oh, I did that. I worked hard for that. That's something that people admire, you know, not that I wanted to be in the spotlight or admired all the time, like in that sense, but you put in the work for it and you're proud of the progress that you're making and you get over like your mental blocks that you have because you are oh, that's heavy. I can't do that. And then you do and you're like, oh my gosh, I did that. <laughs> I got into fitness about in 2013 to try to lose weight. I was over 300 pounds, got into powerlifting to try to lose the weight and then stopped for an amount of time, had a child and then came back. Yeah, at the beginning, I was, I was large. And I got into here not just to lose the weight. When I had lost weight before, it was, okay, I need to lose this amount of weight. I need to lose this amount of weight. Now it's come off so naturally because I'm doing what I love to do. I'm not like hurting myself over, I can only eat this amount of food throughout the day. No, I eat what I wanna eat. I enjoy what I'm doing and I'm not stressing about that. And it's just melted right off, which is nice, you know? And that's been encouraging. I've had people come up to me and be like, you got me to get off the couch because I watched your workout video and that makes me want to do it too. Again, you know, if you can do it, I can do it. And that's been a really fun part of this process. So strongman itself, like a lot of it looks intimidating. You're pressing kegs, you're throwing big stones around, you're running around with sandbags. Like a lot of it looks unconventional, scary. I think that anybody that's getting into something that looks scary, it's the fact of, oh, well, I watched this person go from this to this. I watched this person go from this to this. They're a human being, I'm a human being. Why can't I do it too? It doesn't matter where you've come from or what you have done before, you're always capable of doing the things that you dream of. And there's this idea that I've, a friend of mine told me, like, as long as you are working to be 1% better than the, you were the day before, that's 365% better than you were in, in a year. And that's really, really stuck with me. So yeah, just be 1% better. <laughs> <laughs>